Hello, and welcome to Cuckle's Place. Today, I'm playing Doctor Who, the adventure games. Because they went super cheap, and I was like, hey, I'll play this. And it's been on my wish list forever. I'm a fan of Doctor Who. I know this game is probably not going to be the greatest thing in the world, but I wanted to play it, see what it was about. Oh, it's got different episodes and stuff, too. The City of Daleks. Blood of the Cybermen. TARDIS. Okay. Shadows of the Vasta Narada. Interesting. Alright, let's hit up options really quick. What do we got here? Controls... Uh, apparently I can only use mouse. Got it. Dialogue 1 to 4 keys. Alright. Uh, sound. We're gonna turn a few things down. Music can go down. Effects can go down a bit. We'll leave speech pretty loud and subtitles on. Alright. This is a great start, me changing stuff. Change player. Oh, okay. I guess that's like different profiles, whatever, all right. So, I'm just gonna take a quick look at this, see what's up. It's gonna be a one-off. See who dies. You know, I haven't been doing many one-offs lately, so. Do a one-off, we'll not make this a full series. I doubt it would hold my interest for a full series, but, you know. Episode 1, City of the Daleks. Is this taking place on Skaro? Maybe it's taking place on Skaro. That'd be interesting. I'm also a pretty decent Doctor Who fan. I wouldn't say I'm, like, insane, but, you know, I've watched all the episodes and... I like and enjoy the characters in it, but I'm not uh, like, no, Doctor Who everything. 1963, such a good year. That's uh, the year you bought that outfit then. You know, we can go to see the Beatles play in 1963, but the Ice Age is only a click away on the dial. Can I meet John Lennon? What? Not Ringo. Why doesn't anybody ever want to meet Ringo? I agree. There's no such thing as a sexy drummer. You know, I'd never considered that. Then again, why would I? 1963. The Beatles' first two albums. Sean Connery as James Bond. The Kings, the Rolling Stones. Mary Quant, John Steed and Kathy Gale. All right now, out there, London is the coolest place, not just on Earth, but the whole galaxy. Man, this really looks like a PS2 game. No. Impossible. Did you get this wrong? Maybe this is like 2963 or something. There's no mistake, this is 1963. Oh, look at that. Look at the but things how? just fade out of what? existence. Or, or who could have done this? Something with the power to alter time. On a massive scale. Doctor, look. Human halt! Get down. They actually got the, the voice actors. Are they actors? Will be exterminated! Exterminate! In title sequence with no titles, but probably a mass loading screen. Oh no, there's the titles. You know, why didn't they just put the TV show's actual title sequence here instead of recreating it? It would have looked too good, that's why. We've got to talk to her. Wait. Now we've got to talk to her. Come on. Whoa, okay. Move the mouse to look around the environment. Press the right mouse button to move forward. Oh, tank controls. 
Or you can use the cursor keys to move. Not WASDA with the cursor keys. Oh, no. WASDA works. Never mind. Okay. This... Like, what? when was this made? Probably, like... 2011, 2012? I didn't actually do any research on this beforehand. Oh. Fact. You found a fact! Who fact? Newspapers. The Chinese used to carve blocks of wood in... Okay. This is just a random fact, I guess. It's a fact about newspapers. Gotcha. Cool. Off the edge? No. Oh, oh. Sonic screwdriver. Didn't do anything. Alright. When you get close to something to of interest, it will glow. An icon will appear indicating you can do something with it. And click on it. Yeah, okay. Got it. Oh, oh. You need to find a way to break through the barricade. If you get stuck, don't worry. Press escape to see what you need to do next. Talk to Amy, who might be able to provide some help. She may have several hints, so do try to talk to her. Don't forget, other characters and even objects can provide useful information. I assume we have to move this car. I don't like the way this taxi is balanced. One wrong move and it could come crashing down. That woman escaped down a manhole. We need to find her. <laughs> yes. I'm working on it. Alright, so, wait. How did I bring up my... What button? Ah, there we go. Sonic screwdriver. Use it. Doctor. Do something. Doctor. I, I know I need to move the car. I need to... Um... Okay... What is this thing? Collectibles! You can pick up collectibles as you explore the game. Keep an eye out for them. Collectibles provide you with extra information on the Who universe. Uh, return? Yeah, okay. Awesome. Okay, so we have Daleks there. Stop! Look out for that Dalek! Maybe we can avoid it if we're careful. Now we're playing a stealth game? I guess. You will automatically crouch behind, crouch down when enemies are near. Warning icons will, yes, avoid their cones of vision. Suddenly, it's a stealth game. I hope I can ignore Amy and she can just do whatever. Oh, Mr. Lack of Dolls. Right. Oh, collectible. The Sixth Doctor. Personally, I was never... I, when Matt Smith took over, I was never really that big a fan. Can I not? There we go. We should be safe now. I didn't really like it when he first took over for Tenant. Or whatever, but yeah, he grew This up looks like it could smash through that barrier. Amy, can you give me a hand? Sure. One, two, three! Well, not exactly elegant, but it did the job. It's dark down there. When I said I wanted to meet the Beatles, I meant the band, not the Bucks. Well, you can stay up here and meet the Daleks, but they're more heavy metal. That joke didn't land. You can pick some. You can pick up some items and use them on objects that are glowing. Alright, so this is me using my screwdriver then. Hmm? Be careful down here. You never know what you're gonna find on the underground rats, dinosaurs, yetis. The woman we saw must be around here somewhere. Don't move! Ah, there you are. Hello. Calm down, we're here to help you. How can I trust you? Do we look like Daleks? Us humans have to stick together. I'm the Doctor, by the way. And I'm Amy. Sylvia. 
Tell me what happened. When did the Daleks get here? What do you mean? How can't you know? They overrun the Earth, the whole planet. We've sort of been away. Promise you, Sylvia, we can help you. Just tell us, please. They came out of the sky, like, like they tore a hole in it. Legions of Daleks flying out of it. So many, they turned the sky dark. Thousands and thousands of them. Thousands. Exterminate! They're all red for some reason. I should ask a question. Uh, I don't know. How did you... How did you survive? The Daleks defeated the army straight away. But the ordinary people fought for a while. You learn fast when you have to. Amy, what are you doing with your hand? One woman army? I don't... I, that seems very uncomfortable. The Daleks can't do this. They've never had the power to change time like this before. Change time? What are you talking about? Look, I'm barely hanging on to my sanity as it is. Listen to me, Sylvia. This was not supposed to have happened. 1963 was followed by 1964, and a whole lot more years after that. I have to stop whatever the Daleks have done well, I mean, to make this happen. Technically, Look, Doctor, it, it still isn't safe will to stay be. Here. But... If you want to stay alive now, you have to keep on the move. Let me check ahead. These tunnels are dangerous. What was that? I think it just got even more dangerous. Sylvia is safe. The Daleks can't see her, but we're going to have to be very careful if we're going to get to her. Stealth. Wait. Which way am I going, though? This way, I guess? I don't know. Climb. Okay, I guess we're not going that way then. Which fucking way are we going? Just kind of run behind the Dalek. Ooh. Man, that was easily predictable. <laughs> This is the like most basic of basic stealth gameplay. So Liz Ten. Hello. Okay. Stop. The track is electrified. Then we need to reroute the power somehow and fast. This is going to take some manual rewiring. Uh, are you playing Pipe Dream? Rewire fuse bars. Wires must be positioned to connect two terminals of the same color. Wires cannot cross. Move the mouse pointer over a colored terminal and the pointer will turn to a small hand. Press and hold the left mouse button to drag out a wire. You must then connect the terminal to another matching color. If you disconnect a wire, click on its points and let go. Oh my giblin giblets. Okay. Drag. Get. Oh, wait, wait, what? Oh, this is weird. Wait, where am I trying to get it to go to? Here? Oh, okay, so I wasn't trying to go here, I was trying to go here. Makes sense, I guess. So just really weird and hard to control. Red and yellow stuff over here. So we can't cross the wire. But...
This is so finicky to control. It's like meh. Nee, nee, meh, nee, nee, meh, nee, meh, nee. Yes, thank you. Now it's safe. We better get a move on before that Dalek spots us. Moving on. Up you go, Amy. I just need to set this trap. Hurry. Sylvia! Exterminate! Run, Doctor, run! Exterminate! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> they killed her. What a casual We've got no. to get back to the TARDIS. Doctor, you're really breathy right now. Also, you left the TARDIS out in the open, surrounded by Daleks. I think they would figure out who's here now. Nope. Spacebar also opens that menu. I'm asshole. There you go. What? <sighs> wow. Thank you for that fact. What? Ow. All right. An instant reload. Got it. Come on, climb the thing up, Bob. Climb the thing up, Bob. Uh, all right. So I believe my strategy was quite sound here. Felt it was. Hey, Dalek, don't mind me. Smiler. Guys, guys. We need to hide. Oh. Ignore me! <laughs> okay, so they do react if you get too close to the to behind them. I was testing that. Sorry. Man, this kind of feels like something I would have made. <laughs> Just like the enemy placements and whatnot. It's like it seems like something I made in like school. What? What? From who? Definitely something I would have made in school. Alert! I am a Dalek! You are trespassing in my cone of vision! Seriously, like... Is the cone of vision being cut off, or is he just... Okay. Way over here. Way over here. do 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 Not gonna mess around with him this time, and we're just gonna casually walk past because he's a dumbass. Ta-da! Doctor... Amy? <coughs> it's alright, Amy. You're gonna be alright. I felt so weird. It's going to be alright, Amy. I promise you, if I can analyze the time and place that the Daleks altered the timeline. But I don't get it. If humanity's destroyed in 1963, how am I still here? The TARDIS protects you, but we have to act quickly. Gotcha. What is it? The source of the Daleks' time meddling, it's Scaro. The planet of the Daleks. Coordinates set, we're going back to where it all began. And we're going to save the human race. 
next time. Actually, no, next time. Uh, I think that's a pretty decent look. We're gonna watch this next cutscene thing, which is probably gonna happen immediately. But yeah, I mean, it looks really bad. But if you can get over the really bad looks, I mean, it's okay. It's pretty basic. So if you wanted to extend your Matt Smith era doctoring, I guess you could, because these are all these all are you new stories at least. Like they're unique. They're not copies of ones from the show. It's all right. Nobody home. And they've been busy rebuilding this place, too. Rebuilding? Yeah, Long. look at that art. City of the Daleks. The last time I saw it, it was in ruins, and the Daleks had fled. But now Cologne is reborn. Yeah, well, I'm still not coming here for my holidays. Don't blame you. It never stops raining, so I wouldn't go outside. Even with an umbrella, the atmosphere is 30% sulfuric acid. Ooh, no wonder they're so screwed up. Come on. We have to find the source of the Daleks' time manipulation and stop them. Whatever that takes. Well, like, points for this game. It actually has Matt Smith and, uh, Karen Gillan doing the voices, which is helpful. Uh, it's got the actual music from the show. It's got a lot of stuff. It just looks like a PS2 game. And its controls are a little weird. But, if you could get over that stuff and you're a fan of Doctor Who, I think this game would probably be fine. I might play it a little more after this, but for now, that's the taste. A little tidbit you get. Uh, so yeah, I don't know. I'll play something else next time, but... Yeah, next time. Next time! Next time! Next time! Exterminate!